Welcome to Marina's Kitchen. Today I'm going to make a trifle. I haven't done a trifle for a long time. Um, the, my grandchildren are coming over this afternoon, so instead of having other sweets, I'm going to make them a trifle. I haven't had one for a while. I'm going to make this trifle with Saviati biscuits. You normally would do it with a sponge cake, but I'm going to do it with Saviati biscuits. And I've got my carnation. I've got two tins of carnation evaporated milk here to soak them in. I got some nice uh, peaches in the syrup and I've got a raspberry, a strawberry and a lime jelly. Three types of jelly done. When you're doing your jelly do it a little bit less water because it comes more firmer uh, and that's what we want. So now I'm going to start I'm going to put three of these in the bottom. You have to soak it a little bit in the, in the milk but don't keep them too long because they get very soft very quickly. So I'm going to soak three of them like that. I'm going to put I'm going to put three on the bottom of my bowl, and now I'm going to I'm going to put some uh, maple syrup in my milk. Normally you'd put normally you'd put some masala if you're doing it for growing up, but I'm going to just to put some maple syrup. Uh, it's a maple syrup. It's, I'm just going to put a quarter of a cup in it just to sweeten it up a little bit, okay? So what we do now, I'm going to build this up, just soak them one at a time. They don't take long to soak because they're very, very quickly to soak. Just put them up there like that. Keep on doing the same thing. Just leave them in there for a little while. They just soak up very quickly. I'm just going to add them all up on the side there. Just leave them in until you just sort of get them a little bit soft. Just put them at the side there. I'm just going to put it like that. As I said, I'm going to do this with Saviati biscuits. You could do it with a sponge cake. But I'm just going to, I had some Saviati biscuits inside so I thought I'd do it. Just keep on doing the same thing like that. Dip them in the that lovely creamy evaporated milk just to soften them up. Don't soften them up too much because then they'll soften up with all the jelly and the nice keep on doing the same thing. We can add some more. I'll add one more. I've got three on the bottom and then I've stacked them all on the side like that. Okay? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start building it up with, I've got my custard, I forgot to get my custard out. I've got my custard here and I'm going to put some custard in the, in the bottom of it. I'm just going to pour some custard on the bottom of that, okay. Just on the bottom of those biscuits, I'll pour that lovely custard. Now I'm going to stack up my jelly. I'll put one of the couple of these on the side. I'll put a couple of the strawberry, one on the side, and I'll put a couple of the lime ones. Give it a different colour. You can either have the, the green, the lime, just give it a different colour, okay? And then I'm going to put a few of these peaches, which are lovely. They just give it a lovely bit of a flavour. I, normally you can put some crushed nuts in here, but I don't for my children, I don't. You can do some nice crushed nuts through it. Just put that lovely syrup through like that. And I'm going to add another couple of these biscuits on the top. I'm going to break them up now. And I'm going to put some more on the top there. And then I kind of keep on adding, just keep on adding the whole lot like that. Could keep some more. Okay. And now I'm just going to load it. All you've got to do is keep on building it up. That's all you've got to do. It's so easy. Once you've got everything done, all you've got to do is just keep on building it up with the, the jelly, the fruit, the custard. And just keep on doing it. As I said, when you're doing your jelly, make it a little bit less water so it's nice and firm. And I'll have some more of this colour. We have three kinds of colour here. We've got lime, we've got strawberry and raspberry. Okay, now we have another bit of custard. 
pour in your custard on top of that. Give it a nice amount of custard all around it, which would take it with all those biscuits. Now I'm going to have some more, another layer of biscuits on the top. I've got some more biscuits here. We're going to put some more biscuits on the top. We don't want too many, but another layer of biscuits would be nice. So I'm going to have another layer of this on the top, like that, like that, like that. That's another one there, and that'll be lovely. I think that's enough of my biscuits. And now I'm going to put some more jelly on the top. And finish. I got a packet of each jelly. And as I said, make it more firmer than what the packet says. Less water, so it's more firmer, the jelly's more firmer. Just keep on adding the same thing all the time. There. And I'll have some green jelly to put on the top. It makes a beautiful trifle. The Saviati biscuits make a beautiful trifle. Uh, it's just the same as, I've dipped them in that lovely creamy evaporated milk. Now keep on putting another layer of these beautiful peaches. You can have any fruit you want. You can have the pears if you wanted, but these peaches are lovely. Just put them in all that. Put enough around it. Lovely. Now I'm going to finish it off with some more jelly and I think that's about it. That's nice. Lovely peaches. Puts another one there. We've got enough there. I think that's plenty. You don't want a lot of the syrup. All you want is just the peaches, okay? That's about it. I'll topple up. I might put a bit more custard on the top of that. Yeah, that will take it up a little bit, yeah. yeah that'll fill it up. I think that's nice. I'll finish it off with this jelly now. I'll finish it off with the jelly. Some more jelly on this one. I've got three packets here. One was a strawberry, one's a raspberry, and one's a lime. You can have any colour you want. I'm going to put another one there. And I'm going to put some lime one on the top. That's beautiful. They're going to enjoy this, my grandchildren, this afternoon. And instead of having other sweets, we're going to have a lovely bowl of, of trifle. That's beautiful. That's all I want to do to that. And that will just all soak in. All those biscuits are going to soak in. Now what I'm going to do is, I'm going to, I've got enough jelly in there, that's enough, and I'm going to uh, put a dot of cream on the top, one like that, another one there, just to make it look nice, another one there, Just about four knobs or five knobs of cream. I'm going to put one in the middle. There you go. Lovely. Now I'm going to, I'll just wipe my fingers. I'm going to uh, put some grated chocolate on top of that. Okay. And just some nice grated chocolate on top of that. Beautiful. That's going to be lovely for my grandchildren this afternoon. Look at that. Doesn't that look lovely? And all those biscuits, lovely. All those biscuits will soak into all that lovely jelly. And look, that's beautiful. It makes a lovely presentation of it. And if you have a dish where you can see, see through it, you can see all the biscuits through it and the custard through it. Uh, look, uh, I haven't done one of these for a while, but you know, they are lovely to do with the, for the children. There's something a different, another dessert, different dessert. And uh, just have the peaches, the, the, the creamy, lovely carnation milk. And your three kinds of jelly. It's so quick to make as long as you've got everything 
buy a carton of, you didn't even, I didn't even use a whole carton of that, but you could always use that up after. But look, just have another cream on the top and that makes a beautiful, useful presentation for the kids this afternoon to have it, okay? So I hope you'll enjoy it. Something nice to do. I know it's cold now, but it's still a nice dessert to do. Okay, thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye.